Hey family, it's Ashley, Black Ash Everything, here with another video helping you discover Black-owned businesses and brands for your home and your lifestyle. So I have Hubby here with me again for another video because the products that we're going to be reviewing right now, the whole family used it, so I want to get you pretty much our opinion, um, Royal I guess doesn't have pain. She wipes her butt with anything. And we all wipe our butt with anything. But since we are the not ones, anything. not anything, it was since we are the ones purchasing, we wanted to be able the, the consumers, the purchasers, to give you an opinion on Freedom Toilet Paper. This is a paper goods video. And real paper towels, right? So And real toilet paper, because we did real toilet paper. And we did do real toilet paper real too. Toilet paper. Um, so we're gonna start with freedom, right? Now, I was excited with about Freedom because of the cost, right? The cost per roll, I believe I got like 34 rolls for $29.99, something like that, or $24.99 or $29.99, but it was 34 rolls. So I got 10 more rolls than I would normally get with um, real toilet paper, right? Comes nicely individually packaged, Freedom, Freedom. I keep, I keep thinking of Beyonce every time I say it. But my husband has the, he's the home glum. Home glum? Home glum. Is go. that the rest of my I have a butt too because I agree with him. No, I, so I I, I used this. Yes. Immediately when we got it. Right. Because that was the situation when we got it. Yeah. I was like, throw me some toilet This paper. time I did record him on the toilet. Thank you. You're welcome. It, throw me a roll. Then I caught this. And I opened it up and I began to just... From the moment I opened it up and started using it, I realized mm -hmm. this some cheap toilet paper. It is. This is <laughs> real cheap toilet paper. This is toilet paper you gotta like roll around your hand three, four times. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And then if, if you at your own bathroom, you gotta love you gotta wet it a little bit because it's it's a little it's dry. dry. It's a little dry. It's dry. You gotta moisturize the toilet paper before you wipe the I didn't really know that was a thing. Like that's what they were talking about, like the commercials where they put the pumps of lotion on the toilet paper because it helps it makes it feel like soft and I, listen here. Paper's not moist, but they put the they were putting aloe in the toilet paper. I was like, does that make a difference? But compared to this, I get I it I, makes a difference. I feel the aloe in other ones. You shouldn't have you shouldn't have lint, lint in your drawers after you wipe. No, no. You know, just toilet paper. The, my, the, it got stuck between my draws. cheeks. You know. It do. You got cheeks like that? Man. Yeah. I, people with the cheeks understand. <laughs> people with the cheeks understand that sometimes it, it rips, the, you know, you clench too soon and it rips the toilet paper. So, but now. But. But there's a bit, there's another but. There's a but. This may not be for the home, right? Yeah. Your everyday in your house toilet paper, probably not. But if you run a business, because of the cost, if you run a business like a restaurant or anywhere that you're using like high volumes of toilet high paper, high volumes of toilet paper, and you, need, and you just need to get it in, the get it office, out cheap. yeah, the office or you know like anywhere, it's just like you're gonna have millions of people every day or thousands or hundreds of people coming every day using your bathrooms. I mean, hundreds, twenties, thirties of people. <laughs> it's like is it. It felt because, like what I see when I go to public places. Yes. It was, and I could say that it might be slightly better, slightly better quality than what I've seen in a public restroom. Mm, okay. Right? So it's in that public restroom space. It's public definitely place. not in the, I want to have an intimate moment in the bathroom space. It's not, <laughs> not an intimate moment. Not an intimate moment. You gotta, Me and my laptop. <laughs> <laughs> I'm on Instagram. You know, so... Yes, my we, sports highlights. we this would is not all, what you want to cap it off with. <laughs> we, we do recommend uh, Freedom Toilet Paper, but I wouldn't recommend it for everyday use in mm -hmm. the home. Probably not. I mean, if you, if now, if you also a person who cannot afford, you know, the Charmin's or the, you know, or the real toilet paper, let's just say that. If you can't afford the real toilet paper. And by real, she's saying... Real. real, not like real. Yeah, real. The that, brand real. Not saying you can't. Your cheap ass can't afford no real. You know what I'm saying? Like, oh, okay, you still want to buy black, but you just it's just not yeah. in your price range or your budget. Let's if say you go budget. to Family Dollar and get the one dollar toilet paper, and it and it come with four packs. You can, you can get, get this, this for sure. You can definitely get this yeah. now. Well, we all been there, so yeah, we all been there. So next we have real paper towels, right? Once again. What? Well, you want to stay on toilet paper first and do the real toilet paper? Or you want to oh, we already, I already, we already did that one. Didn't we talked about real toilet paper before? I think so. Did we? Yeah, I did. Okay, I, I wasn't did. in it. You wasn't in it. Oh, 
I did. I have another video. I'll link that video below if you want to know about the real toilet paper. But they had just come out, I think it was the end of last year. They just came out with the paper towels. And I was like, oh, I got to get me some paper towels. I got to try it out. And I love these paper towels. They are super thick. They like, they're like uh, rags when I wash the counter. They don't tear apart. Mm -hmm. They last, like you can wring it out in the sink. Um, these are, once again, these are 100% bamboo, uh, sustainable bamboo toilet paper. I love these paper towels. You can wring it out. You can, you can keep washing or wiping the countertop down. Um, yeah, like I haven't found anything better. I know, I think there is another paper towels company but I'm not quite sure what the name of it. I have to do more research. But so far, I'm very, very, very pleased with the real paper towel. This is dope. <laughs> this is dope. Now I had, I had positive views and controversial views about the toilet paper, but this is dope. I have nothing negative to say about their paper towels. And honestly, not even as a black paper towel, I just like, I would, these are now probably my favorite paper towels. Yeah. So, I mean, yeah. comparable to, um, like, a, what's, what's the bounty? The quilty, quick, Qu Like, I feel like these were a, a lot thicker. They do need a jingle. Yeah, but, like, I was washing dishes, mm -hmm. and you you had a paper towel, and I guess you were cleaning something, and it ended up in the sink, and it had just been sitting there soaking in water, and it was still usable. Really? It was still usable. I was like, what type of... I like, it could have been a washcloth. Yeah, that, that's what I mean, a washcloth. Yeah, it's like it's, a washcloth. These yeah. are great paper towels. This, this boy is going on. I know. We're about to, we're about to yeah, get him. But yeah, guys. So if you, once again, mm, will we buy this for our house again? Probably not. But like one day we're going to have an office. And we'll definitely be using this because we're going to use for freedom. Use for freedom. But we don't have an office right now. So, or a store or whatever. We don't have that right now. But, so, but if freedom decides to come up with a higher quality higher, version, yes. it'd be dope to see. Yes, but this is this is the truth. Now, real paper towels is the truth. We love it. All right. Well, that was our review. Uh, I'll leave the websites to both in the link below or in the bio. And thanks for watching. See you later. Peace.